Okay guys, ready to continue the journey on Pokemon Ultra Sun on Citra Emulator. Let's get into it guys. Last time we beat How. We chose Popio and we beat How. Baby Town is right up those stairs. Come on, water. Let's see if there. Yep, there's an item. Gonna have to battle maybe once or twice, maybe three times to get it. Emulators just having a little bit of trouble, but after a while it should. Water gun. That took him down. Popular grew to level 7. Alright. That's good going, Pop Leo. Raise that special attack. Paralyze heal. That should come in handy when I get paralyzed, which no doubt will happen one of these times. Just got a message. Bunnery. Water gun. It's level two, so maybe it'll paint in one hit. Almost. Defense curl, eh? I think I can still take him out with a pound. Or her, rather. <laughs> Still no Pokeball, so I can't catch any Pokemon. But I haven't seen any water types anyway, so. And I only catch the water types, maybe a few grass types. But probably not because this one has Poke Ride and I don't need HMs. Which is the, one of the best things about this this game. And we're here. This right here is Icky Town. This town is where folks come to worship the Pokemon that watches over Mealy Mealy Island. Tapo Coco keeps us all safe and happy. See? Looks like the Kahuna is nowhere to be found though. Guess there must be some trouble somewhere on the island that needs fixing, yeah? Hal says, yeah, the Kahuna wandered off without a word to anyone, anybody, singing a little ditty or something. I'm gonna go stop by home for a sec. I gotta show my mom Litton. Hey, 
Hey, I've got an idea for you, Water. If you head through the village up the hill, you can visit the ruins that belong to Tapu Koko. That's our island's guardian deity, yeah? Why don't you go and introduce yourself? If you're real lucky, maybe you'll actually get a glimpse of the guardian deity yourself. I'll stick around here and wait to see if the kahuna comes back. Well, I guess there's no point in wandering around talking to everyone. The guide tells me to go. Go right up to it. Hey, old lady. Going to pay your respects to the guardian deity? It's a fickle one, but I hope you meet it. Okay. I know, I know. I'll take you to the ruins, so please stay in the bag. We could get in trouble if anyone sees you. Time to meet Lily. And save Nebby. I remember this part. Ah, what's wrong? Help, save Nebby. The Spiro are attacking it. But I'm not a trainer, I can't. Please. Please save Nebby. I hope your Pokemon for you, so. Alright, let's go save Nebby. Just a moment. Water gun. Take that, you Spiro. Go cool off in the water. <laughs> you managed to chase off one of the Spiro, but oh, there's still more. Please, please help Nubby if you can, but be careful. 
Looks like that attack may have damaged the plank bridge too. Coco saves the day. Tried using your power again, didn't you? Oh, Nebby. You know what happened last time you used it. You couldn't move for ages after that. I don't want to see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nebby. I know you were trying to save me that time, and I couldn't even help you in return. What? What is that? Stone, it almost feels warm somehow. Please forgive me. I'm so grateful to you for helping us out of that dangerous spot. Who are you? I'm Lily. I suppose the stone must belong to you. Seeing Nebby. It's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, Nebby. Um, I'm worried we might get attacked again by some wild Pokemon or something. I know it's too much for me to ask, but you think you could see us back to town? You already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah. Lily, I thought you were with the Kahuna. Kahuna Hala? He said he would he had something to attend to, so he left town on his own. I was just um taking a little stroll up Mahalo Trail when I waited while I waited for him to return. And that's how you met our new neighbor, Water, huh? He just got to Alola yesterday. Help him find his way around, yeah? So you're also one of the professor's acquaintances. Nice to meet you. The Kahuna is back. Kahuna Hala has returned. Our guardian's chosen one is back. Only one of... One of the strongest Pokemon users in all Al Aloya. Have I missed something? There you are, Kahuna Hala. Was there some kind of trouble? Ah ha ha. 
I just got caught up in the middle of some brawling rock rough, that's all. Sorry, Lily, what were you saying before? For some reason I thought I saw a taco coco flying about. Oh, um, yes, Kahuna Hala. Nebby got attacked by some Spiro on the plank bridge, and water here helped protect it. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall to the bottom of the ravine. And that's when the island's guardian deity swooped in to save them. Woo, that's something you don't hear every day. Oh, although it is said to protect us, our Taco Coco is a rather fickle creature. Yet our guardian was moved to save you. Kakui, my boy, I think you have cause to celebrate. Looks like we have a brave kit, a brave and kind new Pokemon trainer in our midst. I'm glad to meet you, child. I'm Hala, the Kahuna of Mili Mili Island. Welcome to Aloya. Young Kakui had told me of your coming. I'm glad we got the chance to meet today. Oh, when did you get out again? I know that Kahuna Hala and the professor will keep you safe from any harm, but you should stay in the bag and out of sight. It's safer that way. Abby, well, it seems you have taken a light seems to have taken a liking to you. I have read that Pokemon like it when you pet them or take care of them, you know. Alright, here's a lovely gift from me to help make today special water. Pokédex. Always get one of those. A Pokédex is a real high-tech kind of tool, yeah. It can automatically record facts about any Pokemon that you meet. Your new partner, Pachu, though, is already registered. Oh yeah, so check it out. And this is a trainer passport that I had put together for you. Well, you got to meet the Kahuna at least. Ready to head home now, Water? I guess so. What does the guide say? Can't just go on to the next page on this one. Oh well, I'll just go on my own. Oh yeah, water, hold up a sec. What is it, how did you forget something? You're seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone before wandering off for a little stroll and a scene without a word? Huh? Hmm, water. Would you be so kind as to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have there? Could it be? Tutu, isn't that? You were rescued by Tapu Koko at the bridge. Isn't that what I heard, Water? Yeah, it rescued me. So even thing to give you a stone. Perhaps you were here in Alola Water, because this is where you are meant to be. Allow me to borrow the stone for now. But not, I'll return it to you tomorrow evening. You have the makings of a brilliant trainer. I can see that light within you, too. You must do us the honor of joining us in the, our festival tomorrow. First, I'll make sure you get back home safe today, though, Water. Lily, and you, you two should come with us too, yeah. 
wouldn't want to go losing you twice in one day. You are that precious Pokemon of yours. Yes, I'll keep an eye on. <laughs> oh, you. Would you not try to escape the very moment that you were told not to wander off? A lot of story in this one. Welcome back, Water. So what did you think of Kahuna Hala? Oh, and look who you've got with you. It came running out to help you. What a sweet little thing. Right there on Route 1. And it saved you. That's amazing. It must have been fate that you met. You look great together. I feel happier just looking at the pair of you. The next day. What a stunning sunset. Alright, today is the day that I finally unpack. Was that the doorbell? Go see who it is, Water. It's Kukui. Hey there, Water. It's about time to set up for the festival, yeah? First, I've got something to teach you, yeah, now that you're a real Pokemon trainer. It's the most basic of all the basics. Come on, to Route 1. Have fun at the festival, sweetie. I'm sure you'll have a good time with your new Pokemon pal. Me and Meow will be sure to unpack every last box here. You'll see. Hurry it up, cousin. Pretend you're a Pokemon and use your agility. <laughs> I think he's gonna teach us how to catch a Pokemon. Yeah, over here. So you know that wild Pokemon Pokemon will sometimes jump out at you in the tall grass, yeah? Well, now that you've got Populo there, you can not only fight wild Pokemon, yeah, but you can also try to catch them. Woo! I'm going to show you how to catch a wild Pokemon, alright? Keep your eyes on the prize. Oh, a wild Grubbin appeared. Kukui sent out Rakura. You gotta weaken a Pokemon up a bit before you try lining up a Pokeball at it. Griffin was caught. He caught a Griffin. Alright, got myself a Griffin. Wild Pokemon do sometimes attack people if you get, they get too close. But catch them and they'll join your team and be a great help to you, yeah? And if your Pokemon get tuckered out, you can always head home and rest up a bit, yeah? Here's some Pokeballs and potions to get you started out.
10 Pokeballs. 5 potions. Plus the one I already got, that makes 6. Why don't you have a little adventure of your own on the way to Icky Town, yeah? Take good care of water, Papalio. Okay, this is a good enough time to stop. Yes. It's almost a half an hour. Try to do half an hour each time. Almost a half an hour, anyway. So, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. And, uh, yeah, have fun.